Welcome to a new episode of our weekly web series, Science in Context. This past week, Montreal was home to the AIDS 2022 conference. I'm Sabina and joining me today is Dr. Jeffrey Eaton. Jeff, what were the key messages you took home from AIDS 2022? It really felt like we're at a pivotal moment in the HIV response. Over the past two and a half years, HIV programs have evolved rapidly and shown incredible resiliency. On the other hand, there's great concern about losing momentum against HIV amid other infectious disease threats and global turmoil. Teams from Botswana presented new survey data that they've already surpassed the 95-95-95 HIV testing and treatment targets for 2025, an almost unimaginable achievement a decade ago. You delivered a keynote presentation on precision public health. Can you explain what this concept entails? Motivated by the concept of precision medicine and the concept of precision public health is can we use new big data data streams to enhance our ability to rapidly identify new public health threats and target prevention to the individuals and communities who are most in need. How can precision public health help define the future of HIV research? Over the past five to six years, we've really seen a revolution in the global HIV response with availability of routine health system data from HIV testing and treatment. This has enabled a much more granular and real-time picture of the HIV epidemic and unmasked large inequalities in both HIV burden and access to treatment. On the other hand, there's some important limitations. First, while a data revolution is underway, we're not fully there yet. New HIV surveillance guidelines released by the World Health Organization at the AIDS 2022 conference map a pathway towards individual level health data systems envisioned by the precision public health paradigm. Second, the nature of HIV transmission at the current stage of the epidemic in Sub-Saharan Africa makes it very challenging to predict exactly who is most at risk for acquiring HIV. Finally, precision public health is focused on individual level data and risk characteristics, but one of the key lessons from the HIV response, and indeed the recent COVID-19 pandemic, is that containing the spread of infectious diseases requires coordinated population level actions and the most effective strategies might not be apparent from focusing on individual risks. Mm -hmm.